Hello everyone, this is Professor Derek A. Smith and I want to welcome you to another CISSP exam essential. Today's essential is essential number 41 and we're going to talk about understand mobile security device application security, understand BYOD, understand embedded systems and static environments, and understand embedded systems and statistic environments security concerns. Let's begin with understand mobile security device application security. The application and the functions used on a mobile device need to be secured. We already know that. Related concepts include things like key management, credential management, authentication, geotagging, encryption, application whitelisting, and transitive trust and authentication. So I'll bring you about understand BYOD. Bring your own device or BYOD is a policy that allows employees to bring their own personal mobile devices to work and then use those devices to connect to or through the company network to business resources and or the internet. Although BYOD may improve employee morale and job satisfaction, it increases security risk to the organization. Related issues include data ownership, support ownership, patch management, antivirus management, forensics, privacy, onboarding and offboarding, adherence to corporate policies, user acceptance, architecture slash infrastructure considerations, legal concerns, acceptable use policies, and onboard cameras and videos are all things we need to be concerned about. Next, let's take a brief look at understanding embedded systems and static environments. An embedded system is typically designed around a limited set of specific functions in relation to the larger product of which it's a component. Static environments are applications, operating systems, hardware sets, or networks that are configured for a specific need, capability, or function, and then set to remain unaltered. Let's move on to understand embedded systems and static environment security concerns. I already told you what static environments are. Static environments, embedded systems, and other limited or single purpose computing environments need security management. These techniques may include network segmentation, security layers, application firewalls, manual updates, firmware version control, wrappers, and control redundancy and diversity. All right, everyone, that is it for essential number 41. I like to keep these brief. If you'd like to get live CISSP training live at home, you can go over to getcisspcertified.com to learn more and also to download my free guide, How to Become a CISSP and Pass the Exam on Your First Try. I'll see you on the next CISSP exam essential. Have a great day.